Stan Jabalisco here to explain the meaning of the word transponder when it comes to communications systems, especially at radio frequencies. A transponder is similar to a repeater, but there's one very important difference. Whereas a repeater reproduces a signal at one frequency, typically, or a pair of frequencies, a transponder reproduces a wide band of frequencies, usually at very high or ultra-high frequencies, that is, 30 megahertz and above, upwards to several gigahertz in some cases. Repeaters are commonly used in ham radio applications at very high frequencies, particularly the 2 meter, uh, one and one quarter meter and 75 centimeter bands. That would be 144 megahertz, 220 megahertz, and 432 megahertz amateur radio bands. And in some cases, even upwards of, of that in the UHF ultra high frequency range. The same is true of transponders. But whereas repeaters are designed to reproduce individual frequencies, uh, transponders are, as I said, wideband devices. They can reproduce an entire range of frequencies and therefore, rather than uh, processing just one signal at a time typically, a transponder can process hundreds or even thousands of signals at a time. The same antenna is often used for transmitting and receiving, but not necessarily. You may have dramatically different wavelengths and dramatically different uh, types of antennas for transmitting and receiving. But in any case, the signal comes in, being received at one frequency, isolated from the transmitted frequency that comes out of the transponder so they don't interfere with one another, a wideband receiver decodes or intercepts the incoming signal. A converter, typical uh, heterodyne type frequency converter, changes that to some other frequency whereupon it is transmitted, amplified, produced with some power, and then back to either the same antenna or a different antenna aimed in the same direction signal comes up from Earth, comes in here, goes like this, processes around, goes back out, back down to Earth, and possibly um, transponders can also exist on the Moon, although there is a significant delay because of the time it takes for the waves to get from the Earth to the Moon and back from the Moon to the Earth, something on the order of a couple of seconds. In any case, that's the main difference between a transponder, as shown here, and a repeater, as you will commonly find in ham radio applications. Stan Gibalisco signing off. Until next time, so long.